Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best headphones for working out. Starting at number 5. Zygo Solo. Using the Zygo Solo headphones for swimming is a bit of a journey, but one that is well worth it. When you purchase, you'll get one headset, one transmitter and stand, one charging case, one pair of earplugs, and one microfiber cloth. And you essentially need all of those items to use the headphones, too. But unlike other swimming headphones where you download music to the integrated MP3, Zygo's buds are a little different. All you have to do is pair your phone with the included transmitter via Bluetooth, and you're good to go. The Zygo headphones use bone conduction at your temples to play music, so your ears are open, you can still use earplugs, and the headset rests at the top of your neck. You can control the volume from the headphones, but won't be able to pause slash play or skip forward or back. One nitpick we had is that the sound quality isn't all that great. However, if you want to listen to a variety of music and podcasts as you swim, Zygo is your best option. Plus, you can use Zygo's headphones for live coaching and with the Zygo app, you can get guided audio workouts. Coming at number 4. Skullcandy Mod. The Mod True wireless earbuds from Skullcandy were a tester favorite mainly due to their compact size and minimal design. They also cost less than $50. Ever tester felt as though these could easily be $80 or more, so the fact they're somewhat budget friendly was a major plus. Although these earbuds don't have active noise cancellation, they do have some great extra features like the customizable listening experience and button settings, plus multi-device pairing. One thing to note is that they require you to turn on both earbuds separately with a press of a side button. This also means you can listen with just one earbud easily, but I oftentimes put them in my ears expecting them to turn on automatically only to wonder why my music hadn't started playing. Like others in this guide, the Mod Buds use a companion app. The app lets you set up certain customizations, like skipping tracks when you press the button on the Buds or switching to Skull Candies here through mode, called Stay Awake. However, this didn't function nearly as well as the Jabra Elite 4 Actives. You can also change up the listening experience with customizable equalizers. Presets include music, podcasts, movies, or a fully customizable mode. Overall, the Skull Candy Mod are a quality, budget earbud that offer a lot despite a modest price tag. At number 3. Apple AirPods Pro, 2nd Gen. The AirPods Pro from Apple aren't necessarily made for active workouts but they are a go-to for many reasons. For one, the sound quality is fantastic, even in a busy gym. This is thanks to its active noise cancellation and spatialized stereo technology. You can easily toggle between ANC and transparency mode on your phone or by pressing and holding the sensor button on the stem of the right AirPod. With spatialized stereo technology, you get an almost surround sound effect in the pods, too. From your phone, you can set it up to be fixed or to track with your head movements, which helps keep the sound optimal no matter what direction outside sound is coming from. The stem touch sensor also controls pause slash play and skip forward or back, but you have to talk to Siri to change the volume or do it on your phone. Also on your phone is where you can do an ear tip fit test to see if the small, medium, or large tips are best for your ears. I'm not sure how accurate it is, though, I tried the test with all different tip sizes and the app always got the conclusion that each tip was the right fit. However, I chose the middle size because, as to my knowledge, my ears are neither big nor small and the middle ear tips felt comfortable and secure with a solid seal. You can also turn on the automatic ear detection, which pauses music when you take an earbud out. Testers found that the pods did jostle around a bit during high impact, sweaty workouts, but were good for low impact activities. Number 2 of my list Bose Sport Earbuds It took me a few tries to figure out how exactly the winged ear tips were supposed to go in my ear, but once in, they were very secure during high impact workouts. They felt a little heavier than some of the more minimalist earbuds, but were still comfortable throughout entire workouts. The other testers stated, too, that even when sweaty, the earbuds didn't slip around at all. The sound, which Bose is known for, is definitely high quality. 
The buds use volume-optimized Active EQ to automatically boost the lows and highs so your music stays on point with every new song. But having the ability to listen to quality audio doesn't mean you should blast your favorite music on 11 while working out. Candice Ortiz Hawkins, an audiologist with Capital Institute of Hearing and Balance and previously an audiologist for the military, told Insider that listening to music too loudly and for too long can definitely be damaging. Headphones should be worn between 60 and 80 decibels, she said, with 60 decibels being the average volume for conversational speech. An easy way to tell if something is too loud is the arm length check. That is if a person is speaking to you at a normal volume, standing approximately one arm length away and you cannot hear them, the volume is too loud. Navigating the earbuds also took some getting used to. To change songs, you need just double touch the outside of the right earbud, which I didn't realize at first since there is no visible button. Although it's a great feature, it's the only touch control available until you downloaded the app. From the app, you can set up volume control with a simple swipe up or down of the right earbud and add a shortcut on the left earbud for things like battery level, skip forward, or skip back. In the app, you'll also see tutorials on how to get the right fit, you have to tuck the wing under your ear ridge, and you can also turn off in-ear detection, which automatically pauses music when you take the right earbud out. If you want to listen to one earbud at a time, you'll have to turn this in-ear detection mode off. And number 1. Jabra Elite 4 Active The Jabra Elite 4 Active earbuds are an all-around, solid headphone option that provides high-quality music, a secure fit, and top active noise cancellation with ear-through, all at a reasonable price. During testing, the earbuds stayed securely in our ears even when jumping rope or running on the treadmill. The outer part of the earbud did seem a little larger and heavier than the inner ear tip, but that didn't compromise fit or comfort even after a few hours. The buds have a waterproof rating of IP57, so don't worry if you get sweaty during a workout. The ANC was fairly good, though not the best we tested. However, the hear-through technology was great to really amplify outside sounds via built-in microphones that pick up sounds around you. One thing the testing team didn't love about the Elite 4 Actives was the need to download a companion app just to connect and set up the buds. The app does provide a lot in terms of specific features like walking you through your headset, teaching you how to use ANC and hear through, and showing how to activate mono earbud mode. It also updates the earbuds quickly and easily, and has settings for what type of music you listen to, neutral, speech, bass boost, etc. The favorite part from all the testers, other than the comfort, was the ability to pause slash play, turn up volume, and turn on ANC right from the earbuds themselves, and not only via a phone. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.